Hi, welcome back to Elder Scrolls Online Greymore. We are continuing the main quest. We need to talk to Zvana. You and Lyris risked your lives for my kingdom and have been met with nothing but suspicion. You counted on my mother to be your advocate, to convince my father of the Coven's threat. Now she's gone. I'm no substitute, but I'll speak for you. Will the High King listen to you? My father hasn't heard a word I've said since I was old enough to talk. But with Mother gone, someone has to make him see reason. You know, she tried to teach me, but I never listened. I guess maybe I'm more like my father than I care to admit. The Coven isn't acting alone. Someone called the Ashen Lord commands the vampires and werewolves. That makes it even more imperative that he heeds your warning and takes action. All of the holds are in danger. Hoffingar, Hjalmarch, Karthald. My father needs to do something before another storm strikes. Meet me at the Blue Palace, all right? I'll meet you at the Blue Palace. I, uh, I just need a moment to think about how to approach this. Consider the words to use. My courtly manners are a bit rusty, and I've never been much for diplomacy and fancy speeches. <sighs> Shore's bones, I could use a drink. All right, so I need to go to the Blue Palace. Talk to the High King. <clears throat> Maybe he'll listen to us now that his daughter is cooperating. He's got like pictures of himself all over the wall. I think that kind of speaks volumes. Led my forces across the realm to search for nightmares you dredged up from a bottle? It's not! Or should I say, the whispers of eastern vipers tickling your ears? But mother! Enough! Then next you come before me to vomit up your counsel. Make sure it doesn't stink of treason. He's honestly the worst. The worst kind of king. Up to Svana. Damn the man. He wouldn't let me get a word in edgewise. Mother always knew how to talk to him. Me, not so much. Tell me how your mother would have handled that. Mother had a way with father, but she could be just as stubborn. If she wanted something done and he wouldn't oblige, she'd do it herself. Time to take her lessons to heart, I guess. If my father won't take a stand, then I suppose it's up to me. Uh, what do you have in mind? Our kingdom consists of three holds. Hoffingar, Hjalmarch, and Karthold. I need to warn them. The Jarls might listen. Even if my father won't. I'm the daughter of the High King, after all. Time to start acting like one. Will you come with me? I'll accompany you to see the the Jarls. We should visit Jarl Redharn of Hjalmarch first. If we can convince him of the threat, at least his hold can take steps to protect itself. We'll find him in his hall in Morthal. I'll leave word for Lyris with Mog so she'll know where to find us. Okay. Go to Marthal. Where is that at? We'll get out here. We can't mount in this courtyard for some reason. All right, where is Morthal? Ah. Down yonder. Okay, so let's go to the way shrine. Fascinating application of the technique. Now the way shrine is outside the city by the river down the hill, so we'll go down there. I see a lot of wardens. <clears throat> I'm debating on that being my next class. I know a lot of people uh, play a lot of alt in Elder Scrolls Online. I think that's because you can like choose your story and you can get like right into other expansions like on a fresh tune so in terms of uh, game design exotic I think I like Elder Scrolls uh, one of the best because there's no like set linear story that you have to follow in order because that just that just really stinks for alternative um, characters you can do whatever story you want in whatever order I think that's great 
Um, also, er everything seems to be level squished, kind of like it is in World of Warcraft. And World of Warcraft, recent, like a year ago, switched to this kind of format, and I think that's really good. Where you put you put that much Lucky in the hands of the player, the they can decide what they can do. All this mud. Oh. Oh, this guy's armor looks sweet. Was that woman a half giant? Like Lyris, the axe warrior of the East? I want his Does armor. Does she have anything to do with those strange sticks we found outside of town? I will be working hard to get this armor. Point me in the right direction, and I'll Why get it. Why does the Princess of Solitude grace my humble hall with her royal presence? Are you here on behalf of the High King? I've come to warn you, Jarl Redhorn. Warn me? I already received orders from your father. What more is there to say? Orders? Uh, right. But you need to prepare the hall's defenses. And what must we defend ourselves against this time? More urns and fetishes? Please, Jarl Redhorn, let my friend explain. The threat to our holds is worse than you can imagine. Hmm. You're not a subject of this realm, and that woman with you. She's the giantess of the East. The High King warned us to beware of packed spies. If Princess Svana trusts you, however, you have my ear. Tell me about this threat. The Ice Reach Coven can summon deadly magical storms. One storm already destroyed a kill wreath temple. We're not Daedra worshippers. Our blood's hot enough to boil a blizzard. We've got more pressing concerns than some northern squall. We received Svargrim's orders, promptly ignored them, and immediately ran afoul of a gaggle of Reachmen. High King Svargrim sent orders. The High King sent a royal decree, said to leave any strange objects or fetishes we spotted around the hold alone. They were dangerous, he said. Just so happens we found a few. I had my soldiers destroy them. That's when we encountered the Reachmen. Sounds like the Ice Reach Coven ritual items. Tell me about the Reachmen that you encountered. The barbarians reacted poorly when we destroyed the strange witch sticks. We beat them back and chased them into the nearby barrow. But that was the last I heard from my soldiers. Since you dealt with this before, would you investigate the barrow? I'll go to the barrow. If I were a few years younger and had more soldiers to spare, I'd march east to the Morthal Barrow and deal with the sorceress nonsense myself. But I'm not, I don't, and I have other responsibilities. Take this key. It will get you into the Barrow. Alright. Sounds like the uh, High King is sort of in on it. <clears throat> Maybe he's orchestrating all this. We need to go to the Morthal Barrel, which is this direction. This is a cool looking little town. This is what I think of when I think of Skyrim, this kind of stuff. Mm, are these players or enemies? See that mound? That's the Barrel. The entrance will be down below. Keep back! The borrow is on... You, Your sir! The borrow is off limits! We are here to make sure nothing gets in or out, and will do so by any means necessary. Y'all Redmayne sent us. He said he hasn't heard from the soldiers he sent to the borrow. I did not want to spare the soldiers I had left to send a message. We destroyed a number of strange sticks set up on the outskirts of town. Then we reached the barrow. We spotted a few rich barbarians. I sent word, and we charged after them. Uh, then what happened? A storm appeared in the barrel, if you could believe such a thing. It was foul magic, almost certainly. Soldiers began changing around me, dying or falling into a stupor. Some turned into monsters, and then the draugr clawed out of their graves. Did, did you see one of the strange sticks in the barrel? We never made it that far inside, and when the storm hit, it was all I could do to get out and seal the door behind us. If the Jarl sent you, and you're intent on entering the barrel, I won't stop you. But if you emerge as a monster... Hmm. Oh, this is cool. Oh, yeah. what? <laughs> all right. So let's review. Um, did we pick up our quest? 
We only have two. So maybe this is part of the main quest. I thought it was a side quest. I can never tell what's the main quest and what's the side quest. I always get so confused with that. I really wish they would make the main quest gold or maybe there's a setting I can do. Okay, whoa. So, <clears throat> looks like we need to go this direction. There's some kind of water or something. Okay. Now we are a stamina dragon knight. So we really excel at the melees. And AoE. We're pretty good at AoE. Oh, stink. I was trying to switch, switch to my bow. And yesterday, the button on my mouse that I've hot peed for my bow broke off. <laughs> no remorse! So, I have another one coming. Uh, I just bought another one. So I probably don't want to remap that. Just cause I, I like the mouse. It just, you know, sometimes buttons fall off. Gaming, I bought a MMO mouse a couple, I don't know, a couple weeks ago on Amazon. And the software that came on it, I understood, <clears throat> excuse me, I understood the software, but the software was just like, it like, slowed everything else down and I started in research and it was like designed for Windows 7 and it it was just not very compatible on Windows 10 and it didn't work very well the mouse would just randomly stop working and uh, I looked up every forum reddit review you know to try and fix it and people all were like yeah it's a great mouse but the software sucks the crown of what is this Lore book discovered. Hmm. So I returned that mouse. I don't know. It's like gaming mice, unless you're willing to pay an arm and a leg, you gotta kinda go with a cheap one. Those bodies. They're the Jarl soldiers. And you know, the downside of a cheap one is it may not last very long. Or like the uh, the buttons on your keyboard will, will wear out. A meager heart. This grave reliquary must be moved to more fruitful fields. Protect the witch pike. Do not let them witch destroy pike. it. Witch pike. Couldn't really hear what you said. We gotta go down. Witch pike. Lost soul. That's the last of them. That's done. Let's tell the Jarl what happened here. Turn to Jarl's Hall. Oh. Gonna climb out of here. Full beans. If I never have to enter another barrow, it will be too soon. Let's ride. Uh, can talk to Lyris. No sign of that witch of the reliquary she ran off with. We should get back to the Jarl's Hall. What do you think we saw down there? We saw the last stand of what could have been a much larger attack on Morthal. The witch pike in the barrow was the only one that wasn't destroyed before they performed the ritual. Soldiers were caught in the harrow storm, but the town was spared. So that's what the soldiers became, Harrow Fiends? That's what happened in Kilkreath after the storm hit. I'm more curious about the witch, though. Why was that grey reliquary important enough for her to grab it and run off as soon as she spotted us? Come on, let's go talk to Jarl Redharn. Yeah!
Anyways, I've not had good luck with mouse mice. Is that the plural for a gaming all mouse over mice? The sword thane's boots. <laughs> ha! This orc friend of yours sounds ah, your companions are Well, friend of Svana, are you as good as your word? Tell me what you discovered at the mortal barrow. Few of your soldiers escaped, but a harrow storm claimed everyone in the barrow. A harrow storm? Like the thing the princess was telling me about? The thing that destroyed Kilkreath? Gods! A pox on the Reach and its barbarian horde! What else? What about the Reachmen in the barrow? We destroyed a witch pike and dealt with the Reachmen, but one of the coven witches got away. Disappointing, but not unexpected. Reach witches are a tricky lot. Still, you have my thanks. In the meantime, Yalmart shall prepare for war. We may not have a defense against the Harrow Storms, but we can be ready to attack once we have a target. As soon as we find out where the coven leaders are hiding, Svana will send word. At least this guy listened to us. With you and Lyris' help, we've gained the trust of Jarl Redhorn. My father respects the Jarl. That will go a long way in convincing the High King to take the coven's threat seriously. Now we need to do the same thing at Carthold. Tell me about Carthold. Jarl Ulfwen rules the Hold which was established to provide a defensible border against the Reach. If any of the Western Holds can deal with this threat, it's Carthold. But first, I have one more thing to discuss with Jarl Redhorn. Jarl Redhorn, prepare your forces as you say, but we need you in solitude. Solitude? I have troubles here in Yarmarch. Why should I leave when my hold needs me? High King Svargrim won't listen to us, but he might listen to you. Get up, Princess. If you think it will help, I'll talk to your father. Lyris, please escort the Jarl to solitude. Of course. What about you? We need to warn Jarl Ulfwen, so we're going to Carthold. Okay, we need to meet her at the Eversnow Inn. Where is the Eversnow Inn? Um... I like well, campfires. Side. They attract interesting people. Yeah. We got quite a ways to ride here. Well, there's a side the quest. Ghosts? Reachmen raids? I'm getting out of this town. I really don't want to do any side quests. I I get way too confused when it comes to side quests. Yeah. And sidetrack. I want to do the main quest first, and then I'll come back and do side quests. Is that a player? That is a player. Why is he doing there? It's a really beautiful zone. I'm really enjoying playing all these different MMOs and just like looking at all the de what the developers have done. Lord of the Rings Online is like a really cool, uh, pretty zones in its own right, its own graphics. Uh, Mass Effect is the other one I've been playing here recently, the Legendary Edition. That's really awesome, open world like in space. You know, and this one's really cool too. This has very unique art style graphics. I really like the class. Um, Sort of infrastructure, how how abilities work. That's really fun. I like that. You know, I started playing Elder Scrolls like a year ago, but I don't feel behind. That's something in an in an MMO that's very rare. Like if I if I were to have just started like World of Warcraft or uh, I guess Lord of the Rings, uh, or if I were to jump on New World, I would feel like really behind. I'm sure. Because, you know, I'm playing way later than everyone else started it. Because this game is so story-driven. There are raids, there are PvP, but... Um, if you're just focusing on the story... And I can jump into any expansion. I think that's great. They've really done a good job with this. 
it's very immersive even like the standard ui there's like hardly anything on your screen i like that a lot there's so many things i really like about this game i also like that there's a subscription if you want to you know pay for it you get things out of it but you can also play it free i think that's great Stay inside. Stick together. We'll... we'll take care of this. These people... they're from Carthwatch. They... might be all that's left of the town. What happened to Carthwatch? They say it was a storm. Powerful. Devastating. It engulfed the entire town. It had to be a hero storm. That's the only explanation. There could be other survivors. Maybe even Jarl Ulfwen. We need to make a search. All right, let's head into Carthwatch. Let's hurry. Every second we waste could be the difference between life or death. Okay. So to the left, up the way. You escaped the battle? No matter. This time we'll harvest all of the Grey Reliquaries. That's oh. Coven Witch. Is she the one that escapes from the barrel? Apparently. She just disappeared too, so apparently she's a vampire. Too bad you arrived so late. Your life energy would fit perfectly in my reliquaries. Reliquary? Vampiric bear. That's terrifying. Huh. Look at these guys. Bah, they come. Protect the Grey Reliquary with your lives! Well... <laughs> Come and Whoa. take us! I was say, I guy's putting up a fight, but... That's got it! The big boy. I need a moment. Skill go skull talk guard. over there. What's all this red stuff? Is that the horror storm? Gods, did all this death serve some dark purpose? Sorry, guess I'm not completely used to the fighting and all. That urn, though, the Grey Reliquary. The witch was adamant about protecting it, gathering it up. She said something about our life energy. Oh, gods, I think I know what they're doing. Tell me what you think you figured Remember out. Remember what the witch said as we approached the town. This time we'll harvest all the Grey Reliquaries, she said. That our life energy would have fit perfectly in the urns. I think the Hera Storm steals life energy and puts it in the Reliquaries. So what do you want to do, Princess? If the Jarl is still alive, she can take care of herself for a while longer. The Witch hasn't gathered all the Reliquaries yet. I say we get to them first and destroy them. I won't let these bastards profit off the destruction of Carthwatch. All right, let's destroy the Grey Reliquaries. We got three of those. So after I'm done with Greymore, I intend on taking more time in Greymore than I did Blackwatch. I didn't do <laughs> any really side quests in Blackwatch. Blackwood, not Blackwatch. Um, I could go back and do side quests in uh, Blackwood. I liked that expansion. I think my favorite thing about it, honestly, was the uh, companion thing. So I have Bastion as a companion. He can travel to me to all these other... Now, there's, an, there's another companion I can unlock. And I would probably do that at some point. But I don't really need a healer. And I don't really need, like, a tank. So I think Bastion's a good fit for me. Because I have some pretty good self-sustain. And... I don't really need to tank because I'm obviously going to be meleeing things. 
Oh, so the red tornado I saw earlier is the Haro Storm. Damn, that thing looks nuts. For glory! You could not stop Oh, this is her right here. And you cannot stop me. Are you gonna turn? Nope, you're just gonna die. Like, is she gonna turn into one of those werewolves or? That one guy turned into like a like some kind of prime vampire. It was really cool. That's done. Now let's check on the yard. Her hall is right up the hill. Straight ahead. Over the biggest one, huh? So I think after I'm done with Greymore, maybe some side quests, I think the next expansion I want to do is elsewhere, because that's the one that has the dragons. I would love to fight some dragons. That sounds really fun. And then there's Somerset. Um, Stay back. Don't there's like three me. or four others. Oh, you're not one of the witches or their monsters. I, I thought this was the end for me. I barely have the strength left to conjure a light breeze. Wait a moment. Is that Princess Svana? Svana and I are here to help. Tell me who you are and what happened here. I'm Magister Fridelia. I serve Jarl Orfren as her court mage. I've been fending off witches, vampires, and these crazed villagers since the chaos started. There was a storm, definitely magical in nature. It turned our own people against us. What about Jarl Offwin? Is she still alive? I... I'm not sure. I sent the Jarl into the cellar when the storm began. When I still thought it was just a bad storm. Please, go downstairs. Make sure the Jarl is safe. Kartold will be lost without her. I'll find the Jarl. The cellar. Jarl Orfwen is in the cellar. Make sure that she's all right. Okay. Like all this Nordic and uh Uh oh. Yarl nope, she's Orfwen. definitely no. not alright. <laughs> I, I need to get some air. Please recover the crown of Carthold. We can't leave it down here. The day will be ours. She is definitely a zombie. Bastion's taking aggro. Well. So why does it turn some people into zombie or hero fiends and other people it doesn't seem to affect? I'm sorry, Fidelia. Jarl Ulfwen, she's... <sighs> That's the Carthol crown. Jarl Olfwen's gone, then? I failed her. You did everything you could. It's a wonder you weren't infected by the Harrow Storm. That's exactly what I'm th thinking. Harrow Storm? Is that what you call what happened here? Why I didn't turn into a monster is a mystery. Wait. The Hold soldiers clashed with Reachmen scouts a few days ago. They brought back these medallions the scouts were wearing. An Ice Reach Coven medallion? I've seen them before. You had this one on you the entire time? Yes. I was preparing to study the enchantments I detected upon it when the Harrow Storm struck. I guess I slipped it into my pocket without really thinking about it. Pocket? Could this be some sort of protection against the storm? It certainly seems possible. We might be able to see the knowledge to protect the kingdom. <sighs> Talk to his father. Garth Watch is gone. No people, no Yara. The seat of the entire hold. Wiped out. Just like that. I have to get my father to take action! What should we do now? I need to get back to the Eversnow and gather the survivors. Take them to Solitude, where they'll be safe. At least as safe as we can make them. Then I have to have a serious talk with my father. I'll make him listen to me, damn it, no matter what! Uh, what do you want me to do? Return to Solitude. Find Lyris and meet me in the Blue Palace. I have a room upstairs that we can use. We need to come up with a plan. Something that will help me convince my father to act. Okay, I'll find Lyris and go to the castle. Castle. Magister Fridelia, 
as the highest ranking official remaining from the court of conflict. All right, can we get a way shrine? Because we are stinking way over here. This is a really big zone. I'm not afraid of you. Those are villains. All right, let's look for a way shrine. Let's just sort of... Oh. I think I did run past the way shrine. Just didn't activate it. Sometimes I get confused on how that is. Like, is it proximity activated or do you have to click on it? Sometimes I can't figure out what's going on there. So it is proximity. Okay. All right. Back to um, solitude. Yeah. I like that <clears throat> solitude in like the the blue palace is like hanging over a precipice. Yeah. That's neat. I wonder why those are blue. I need to figure that out. Yeah. Sort of explore what's going on there. I played the base game, and I didn't have, like, I, I started completely from scratch. Never played it before. Right and behind you, my horse was so slow, and it ran out of stamina. And, like, I, it was honestly fast. I, I actually timed it and tested it. It was faster to just run the moment the <laughs> on foot the gorge, than it was to ride a horse. On, it was hilarious. Glad to see you're alive and well. I was getting worried with all the Harrowed they've been bringing into the city. What are they doing with the Harrowed? They've been taking them to the Temple of the Divines in Castle Dower. I suppose it's really the only place to care for them in their condition. So High King Svargan is finally taking our warning seriously? Y'all Redharn gave him an earful the moment we entered the Blue Palace. Nord politics. It's a wonder to behold. One step removed from a barroom brawl. I'm disappointed they didn't start slugging each other, but it worked out in the end. <laughs> We reached Karth Watch too late. It was destroyed by the Horror Storm. Oh, damn it. I was afraid of that. We're running out of time and we still don't fully understand what we're facing out there. Hey, where's the princess? Tell me you didn't lose Svana in Karth Watch. Svana's fine. She wants to meet up in the Chamber of the Blue Palace. So talk to Svana in the Blue Palace. Yeah. Really like this city. Seems very, very flushed out. The castle in Blackwatch, Blackwatch, Blackwood, didn't seem this uh, populated and fleshed out. I heard, um, I was looking at, like, the most highly rated, best reviewed ESO expansions, and Greymoor, I think Greymoor was number one, number two, Somerset was, like, number one for a lot of people. A lot of people liked Elsewhere. But I didn't look on any reviews for uh, Blackwood. I just played it. Blackwood was fun. I liked it. But I don't. That was my first expansion, so I don't really have any metric for. Swana, I know, would leave all this bother behind. Come back to the troll well, and let the royalty. I don't want to steal anything. This. I am the royalty, Mog. It's time I. Welcome to the princess's chamber, my friend. I don't remember the last time I spent more than a few moments in here. Anyway. Jarl Redharn and Magister Fridelia are here, giving my father an earful. Thanks for helping me at the holds. We weren't able to save Karthwatch. No, but we saved Morthal, and stopped the Coven from getting the Grey Reliquaries at Karthwatch. And we brought the hold leaders here. All of that matters. Take this, my royal allowance. I was going to buy wine, but you can make better use of it. <laughs> All right. Well, we got a heavy... This is more armor. But it's m maximum health. Increased items armor value. So it's actually... Really, we, we have maximum stamina. We're a stamina Dragonite. It's really not better we than what we have. We've that my father is finally doing something about the Coven threat. But it's not enough. Extra patrols and rounding up the Herald is all well and good. But what we really need is a defense against the Harrow Storms. 
All right, so First we will. First time in a princess's chamber, my friend. What? <laughs> we will continue um, this whole main quest chain in the next episode. <laughs>